What's up, Trojans? I'm CJ. I'm Dom. And I'm Hannah. And welcome back to our TNT broadcast. We have a lot of current updates, so please like and subscribe to our weekly broadcast. You'll find us at youtube.com slash TPS television. It's simple and easy. Just click that subscribe button now. We are starting the second trimester of the year now. How you guys feel about classes? Oh, uh, my classes are pretty easy. Nothing too difficult. Got digital media again, which I like a lot. So that's, that's good. I'm in horticulture and landscaping right now, and I'm really looking forward to planting today. I'm enjoying my uh, my gym and my woodshop classes. Sounds so. easy. Sounds like a good time. Oh, yeah. It sure is getting close to the holiday season. I mean, what are you guys looking forward to? Um, I just like spending time with family. Honestly, some family I don't get to see very often. It's nice to be able to see them. Uh, it sure is nice. Uh, I'm looking forward to resting up, you know, football season being over. I can finally just relax. So. Yeah, take a little time to yourself. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm looking forward to baking uh, my famous holiday homemade cookies. So. You're going to have to bring some in and share. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Speaking of the holidays, this Saturday, the annual Trenton Christmas Parade will be at 6 p.m. in downtown Trenton. The parade is a festive holiday celebration with a Trenton marching band in attendance, along with many other groups to celebrate the holiday season. Even Santa will be there. Make sure to join us after at the City Hall for hot chocolate and cookies. I'm definitely looking forward to those cookies and especially that hot chocolate. Since it's going to be so cold, I wonder what the weather will be like. Well, you're in luck, CJ. It's time for our weather segment. Good evening, Trojans. I'm McKenna with the weather. Today is going to be looking pretty cloudy with a high of 46 and a low of 39. We're looking at about 16 mile per hour winds. Now, as for the weather this weekend, it's going to continue to be pretty cloudy with some strong winds on Saturday and a high of 48. And on Sunday, we're looking at a high of 38 with partly cloudy skies. That's all I have for the weather today. Back to you, anchors. Wow, all that cold weather. It sure is starting to feel like winter. Speaking of, when is the Winter Solstice concert? The concert is Tuesday, December 13th. It starts at 7 p.m. with Mr. Wolf conducting the Trenton High School concert and symphony band along with the choir. Sounds like it would be a good time. Make sure to attend and show support to your arts. Check out a new views photography senior session manned by our very own senior, Isabella Frendo. She is booking senior sessions now. $100 is a great price for senior photos. Her photos are absolutely amazing. Did you hear she's a district photographer now? Make sure to check her out her flyer. We have some awesome sports updates and we're here to deliver. the start of the winter season, so there's a lot of news to get into. First, let's talk basketball. The boys' varsity team has two games. One's against Riverview on the 6th, which is away at 7 p.m., along with another away game against Gabriel Richard on, at 7.30 on the 8th. For girls' varsity basketball, they have three games. The first one is on Saturday. At a, it's away at Marion High School in Franklin at 4 p.m. On December 6th, they will be playing Allen Park here at home at 6 p.m. And then again on the 8th, the girls will be away at Wynap for a 6 o'clock tip. Over on the ice, the hockey team started hot this season with a strong 3-1 record. They're hoping to keep up the excellent work this Saturday at the Kennedy against Woodhaven at 7.30 p.m. Then the boys are back at home for the big game against OLL. OLSM at 7.30 p.m. Make sure you guys come out and support the boys and girls this week and go blue. That's a lot of games this week. I'm sure the yearbook photographers will be there taking amazing pictures. Which reminds me, the yearbook committee has been hard at work making this year's yearbook. So make sure to check out www.yearbookforever.com to purchase yours today. Remember, the longer you wait, the more expensive they get. I'm sure you've seen on the TVs displaying a QR code lately. Seniors, this is for you. Make sure to scan the screen now to upload pictures of, your f of you or your friends for the annual senior video that will be played at graduation. Don't miss out. In other news, the Christian Impact Club is meeting every Thursday at 7 a.m. in room F233. So make sure to join in to be involved in some uplifting words related to scripture to start the school day. That sounds nice. It sure does. Now on to our last announcements for this afternoon. Have you ever wanted to know who has been creating the lunch and cafe chalkboard signs? Now we have the answer for you. Every day. 
Over 900 Trenton High School students eat lunch in our two cafeterias. Every day, they are greeted by handcrafted signs. Oh my god, that's such a cute sign! I wonder who made it. But the question remains, who creates these signs? This is Kara. Oh hey, you didn't see you there! She is a new hire to the Trenton Lunch Lady staff. She themes the signs after current events, like Thanksgiving. Hi, my name is Kara, and um, I just like to doodle on y'all signs for y'all's sake and to make lunch more fun for you guys. It's just a side hobby that I picked up on the way. Wow, make sure to give a little extra kindness to our kitchen staff. They put in a lot of hard work for us. Oh, yeah. The holiday season is just around the corner, starting on December 23rd through January 9th. The TPS TV crew interviewed our students and the staff about some of their favorite holiday activities. I know my favorite holiday activities are just spending time with me, my family, and my friends, sleeping in and eating ice cream. I just ate two large blizzards yesterday, actually. Yum, yum. Let's check out that video now. So your name is? Miss Gaddish. That's great to hear. Now, what's your favorite activity to do during the holiday season? I like to decorate with my sister and my daughter, Josie. That sounds fantastic. What's your name? Maya. And what is your favorite activity to do around the holidays? Probably watch the bad Christmas movies at Hallmark. That's a good answer. There are also a lot of scholarship opportunities that are posted in your Q Communication and in the Counseling Office Schoology Group. You can stop by and see Mrs. Riley in the Career Center for more information. And with that, thank you for watching TNT News. I'm CJ. I'm Hannah. And I'm Dom. Have a great rest of your day.